Police are holding two suspects over an illegal fuel siphoning racket in Mlolongo. Area police say they were alerted of the suspicious activity by residents in the neighborhood, leading to the shocking discovery of the syndicate that has been stealing thousands of liters of fuel from the Kenya Pipeline Company. Let's get more from our very own Kimani Mbogua. A sophisticated crime with a script pulled out of a movie was happening hidden in plain sight in Lulongo in the outskirts of Nairobi. Criminals illegally siphoning fuel from the Kenya Pipeline's mainline through an underground tunnel and distributing it from this site disguised as clean water in a racket that ran undetected for an unknown period of time. Two people have been arrested and the one whom we were told uh, was asked to go and switch off the tap so that the fuel stops flowing, went down a tunnel. They have dug a tunnel behind us where they do the connection. So he went through the tunnel and disappeared. So we don't know if he came out or if he got overwhelmed with the fumes and uh, he has succumbed to the fumes underground. Engineers and technical staff from Kenya Pipeline forced to use portable tanks to collect the fuel that was already siphoned from the pipeline, marking off the area to prevent any spillage or fire incident. It is not the first time KPC has had to deal with illegal siphoning schemes as it was forced to recall about 170,000 litres of super petrol in its Kisumu depot last year after the fuel was discovered to have been contaminated with huge amounts of water due to illegal siphoning schemes along its Kisumu Kipos Road pipeline. The company blaming illegal structures next to the pipelines for such schemes. Structures like this one behind here is going to be destroyed. And we are going to, 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 to spearhead uh, an exercise where we are going to give notices to people who are encroaching on the right of way so that they move away. If they don't move away using the uh, lawful means, we are going to make sure that we enforce that movement so that we safeguard the pipeline and the products it transports. Police are still looking for one suspect who escaped the Mlolongo illegal structure. The other two expected to be arraigned in court on Thursday. Kimani Mbogwa, JKL.